what we're doing today, or in this episode, I've got my new mine lab detector, my Goldbug Monster 1000. And all my nice little toys and trinkets I got with it, my pin pointer, my scoops. I've got my shovel in the in the Jeep. I gotta go get it. So uh, since I don't have a whole lot of time having to work the weekend, Dustin's out here with his high banker and running material. So I'm gonna swing the detector. I'm gonna try to figure this mine lab out and, and work it and see what I can dig up and find. And uh, another on another quick note, stay tuned to the very end. Got a, got a pretty big announcement to make. I think you're gonna like it. So anyway, Dustin, let me uh, grab that camera from you. Yeah, we'll I don't think they were. all right. You got it. Well, hey, poor show. You got everything set up now. How long have you been out here? What time did you get out here? I don't know, seven or something. Seven o'clock. So you were out here in, in 32 degree weather, basically. I spent a lot of time in my truck getting warm. <laughs> and is this the first yeah, clean out? That's the ninth first one. I got out here, and this is his first clean out. That is nice. That is real nice. Would you look at that? Just look at it. Wow. That's some, man, that's some, that's some real peppery stuff. Yeah, for here, it's really good stuff. Anything down here, did you? I don't know. Maybe. I may yeah, have you can see the out. red, and that's a lot of, gar like, garnet oh, sand. Oh, wait till you see the garnets I pulled out of it. They're huge. I actually sucked them up in here. Let's see the garnets, see what you got. Oh wow. Let's just take a there's two huge ones right there. I'll show you the garnets we've been getting up this. Actually let's get it let's show you in the That's sun. What I'm trying to do. Yeah, let's see it. Yeah, that's some beautiful red garnets. Wow. Yeah, that's what I love about it out here. You find some gold, and there's uh, people that actually found diamonds out here, too. That's but the garnets, and so you're working right there, huh? Yeah, right where the nozzle is. Oh, you're working over there. Okay, I thought you were working in, someone's worked this right here. That was me. That's, okay. Uh, a couple weeks ago or something. So you're working right out there, where that green nozzle is. Yeah, you're doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. So anyway, I am gonna get this. Uh, and I brought my little thing he gave us. So a uh, little Could squirt bottle. There you go, Terry Bryan. Look at there. I was gonna say, sir, Terry left a, a message in the last uh, video. Yes, he did. Now. Okay, I'm bringing it. Just to show <laughs> it. That's a good thing. That's a good thing you did. All right. Well, I'm gonna. I'm gonna clean out this bottom mat, and then I'm gonna get back out. Yeah, and I'm gonna put this up, but I'm gonna start swinging. I've got. This little yellow container right here, I can swing my detector on. I gotta then shut her down. All right, well, you're gonna be running. I'm gonna throw my headphones on and I'm gonna swing this thing and see if I can't find something. So, I guess until then, we'll be back. I'll show you where I'd swing it. Well, decided to take a break and come over here and I just kind of started looking around for some geodes. Got Dustin running. 
It's about 36, 38 degree weather today right now. Some of the geodes right there, 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 there. And also around here, what I normally call quartz, I guess uh, these are called river pearls. I'll show you. Right here, they call them river pearls. Right there. Different colors, reds, orange, yellow, white. So, I've just been going around picking up these, what I'm going to call them quartz, or river pearls. And uh, looking for geodes as I took a break. He's in a good spot, I can tell you that much. Alright, well, a couple more minutes and I'm going to get back to detecting. If I find something worth showing, I'll bring it back on. We'll be back. Alright. I hid Dennis's gold thing so he can figure out what it sounds like if you find gold so, actually underground. So somewhere behind me, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> he took my nugget. I got to remember where I put it. Right here. Mark your targets. That's a big target. Man, this whole area is just loaded. One target back there, it went nuts. I bet that's it. Yeah, they can go that high. I'm just telling you. That's metal there. Yeah, that's going crazy. Well, dig it. See if it is. I don't think so. There's something in there. It ain't your gold. Metal. Yep. yep. All right. 
Neville. You need to keep going this way. All right. this detector. There it is. <laughs> and there it is. So you went over that spot once and walked away from it. And I yeah. was like, ah, oh, you better turn around. I just got to learn the sounds of it and learn, you know, learn how to set the sensitivities and everything. Yeah. yeah. I just got it. This is the first time I'm actually playing with it. Because you got that big hit back there that you marked. I was like, I hope you don't think that's it, because that sure ain't it. I'm gonna mark it. Is that it right there with the stick? No, it was the other stick right here. Somewhere right in here. Same sound. Same sound as that. Yeah. No, oh, that's got a little different pitch. Do it again. Yeah, that's the same sound. You're right. You'd think it'd be, it seems like, look underneath that big rock. That's where it sounded like it was coming from. Tab. So you got to figure out how to get these tones set. Yeah, I do. Yeah, that was it. Well, got another piece of trash out of here. You're about ready to do a clean out, aren't you? Yes, sir. Well, I'll tell you what. I will get this stuff put up because I'm about I'm about done uh, metal detecting for the day, and we'll go back over there. We'll bring it back on. We'll do a clean out and uh, show you some gold, hopefully. So we'll be back. All right, so you already got your uh, top mat out. Yeah. Cleaning it up. Yeah, I'm just sucking out some of the big garnets. Holy cows, there's a lot of garnets in that. Yeah, but you should have seen, I, I sucked one out of here. I didn't know if it'd go in the straw. Wow. That's some beautiful garnet. Yeah, that's why I didn't pan it down any further because I wanted to get some of these big garnets out of here. Got one ruby red. It's not very big, but it's still ruby red. I won't get any more. I'll just pan it back. Well, maybe I'll get that one down there. I don't know if I'll get much gold, but I got some killer garnets. Yeah, you do. I hope you got some gold in that. You haven't found any gold yet since you pinned that down? No, I haven't even pinned it down. I just kind of worked some of the stuff off of it. Yeah. I can see some in it now. That's a big darn it. But I did, I found some monster ones a minute ago. It came out of here. All right, we'll be back in a second. As soon as you get down to the gold and get the other stuff panned out. Ooh, that's a nice one there. All right. 
Got her. All right. He gets that pan down. We'll be back. Okay. Here we is. There it is right there. That's uh that's not some bad that's some yeah, that is some peppery stuff. Yes, sir. That was just the top mat too. Yes, sir. He's still got more to go. And look at that red garnet's had some beautiful beautiful red you garnet black sand. You mm. should have seen some of the pieces I just pulled out of this one, some of the garnets I just pulled out. Oh I did. I got it on there. I got her on well, the... the ones before you came down and started recording. Man, I pulled out a big one. Heck yeah. It's, uh, yeah, it's a little bit chilly today. Look at that. Look at that, Terry. He's using the, using the squirt bottle. Yeah, I gotta fill it back up. Fill it back up. It's about empty. Yeah, at least you get a... Yeah, I need some more water. You got to show it on there. It's a little chilly. I hate having to go into work tonight. I'm still going to try to get up and do my Saturday talk. I try to do it uh, Saturdays at 8 o'clock. Oh, my nose is running. My refrigerator. There we go. There you go, Terry. There you go. See, I'm using Look it. Look at that. He's using it. And there goes that gold. All right, well, I got a generator to load. That one there is going to go on the back of my Jeep. Or, uh, yeah, a pump. Not a generator, a pump. It's almost too big for what I needed. So, you want to use it out west. Yeah, I use that for my yeah. my big gold hog that I got out there. Yeah, at three inch. Tell them it, this thing's a monster. I nicked it down to. Yeah, that is one big sucker there, so. You can mount some wheels on it. Yeah, that'll that'll work perfect for my claims in Idaho that we need. It's only ever been used at the pit. So anyway, that's uh that's about it. We uh short run today, at least for me. I know you're gonna be here for a little bit longer, huh? Yeah, a couple more hours. A couple more hours. But uh I, can't take it no more. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this short video of Want to call it COVID gold? Yeah, COVID gold. COVID gold. And uh, don't forget to uh, rate, share, subscribe, and leave a comment. Love to hear what you guys got to say. Um, another thing on those, uh, like I said before, on the uh, uh, Gold Claw Gold Pans, if you guys want one, go to goldclaw.com and enter the code IGH for 10% uh, off. Um, your order and uh, you can also go to magnet trap if you guys want any of those those magnet traps that uh, Eric makes um, you put in your code there and get 10% uh, off and uh, that is uh, www.thenarl.com now the goat call I can't remember I'll have to get a hold of Clint it's either 5% or 10% off I've been saying 10% but I'm not I, I think we I, I'll have to ask him Either way, five or ten percent off is still five or ten percent off your order on the Go Claw. But uh, the big announcement I got, just to let everybody know, it's a two part. It's a two part that I got, and part one is I'm going to have, and I'm just going to show you now. This isn't going to be it, but I'm going to be uh, giving away one gram of gold. If I can find a, a, a one gram nugget or close to a one gram nugget, right at one gram, I'm going to be giving away a one gram, one gram of gold. I'll just put it to you that way. What you have to do to be eligible for this gold, and we're going to, this is going to be kind of like my, for all my subscribers, um, it's going to be, you have to leave in a comment, I want in. Three words, that's it. Not count me in, I want in, I want in, I want just I want in. Nothing else. I want in. You have to leave a comment. Now you can you can leave another comment somewhere else. But if you want entered for this gold giveaway, well not this one, but for one gram of gold, you got to leave a comment. I want in. I'm also going to go over to my other YouTube channel, which is called IGH Outdoors, and I'm just going to leave a short video on on that about the contest. You have to go over there and leave a comment. I want in and 
you have to be a subscribed to both channels. So to be eligible, you have to subscribe to this channel and subscribe to my IGH Outdoors channel and leave a comment, I want in, has to be three words and three words only, nothing before it, nothing after it, I want in, in the comment in this video and in the comment I'll leave on my IGH Outdoors channel, just to be real short, and I'll call it COVID Gold Part 2. Well, this one's going to be COVID Gold and then COVID Gold Part 2. So anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, you got to see some gold. Got to show you my inexperience on the Mine Lab Gold Monster 1000. I think at the beginning of the video, I called it the Mine Lab Bug. Isn't that what I called it? I don't even remember. Mine Lab Bug 1000. <laughs> I'm thinking of my Gold Bug Pro 2 that I have. So I've got two detectors now. So anyway, um, that's it. And till my next adventure, this is Dennis Dayton with Dustin Beer behind the camera. This is Indiana Goat Hunter.